The struggle of every vlogger's life, trying to find out if this is in focus. Hey guys, and welcome to Motivation Monday, the day where I help you guys stay motivated for the rest of the week. This is actually my first edited video doing this, so you actually can see what my videos look like when they're decent. So like, today's topic, we're gonna talk about like, getting over like an ex, cause like, you don't need their shit anymore. You need to just get over it. I know it's really hard to actually get over someone you used to love, or someone you actually used to care for a lot, and someone who you used to like to spend your nights with, and someone you used to get to just call and just like have booty sex all the time. It's just like the best thing ever. You guys go your separate ways, you just couldn't just grow together, and you thought you could be together forever, and then you just separate. But eventually you have to learn to move on and grow from it. Now I know how you might be feeling now, like things aren't working out for you. Then you just have to learn to move on, be independent. Remember that you were you before you even met them. You're always going to be you. You don't really need them in your life to have such a giant impact. Because you're yourself. You're an individual and you should love yourself for that. But don't just mope around thinking about what happened or thinking about, I just can't move on from this person, like that person was everything to me. Because like, no. You can be yourself, you can be your own, and you can go out there, you can find another person, and even if you don't, you don't need another person to be happy. Hey girl, you don't need no man. You are strong, you are independent, you is smart, you is kind, you is important, that's right, baby girl, that's right. But you also have to remember the reason why you guys broke up. Because if it was a problem that was so big that you couldn't fix, I mean, that's the thing that led to your breakup. That's why you're not together anymore. But if that got cheated on you, uh-uh, bitch. I ain't having that. I'm gonna take my earrings. Uh -uh. No man's gonna disrespect me like that. Uh-uh. No one's gonna get all of this and then some of that. Uh -uh. I'm not gonna be your own side chick. Uh-uh. I'll play that shit. Uh -uh. I'll cut a bitch. I'll cut a bitch right there. I'll cut off his balls. And I'll tape it. I'll chuck down his throat. Uh -uh. Ain't no man gonna play me like that. Uh-uh. I'll go straight up fucking dexed on his ass. Uh -uh. I got this shit. Uh -uh. And I know soon people like to compare a relationship to like a good book. You will never move on if you keep rereading the pages over and over and over again. That doesn't make any sense. If it's a good book, you're gonna reread the pages. I don't... It, d d uh, did they not read Harry Potter? I would say any relationship relates more to a movie. Because it's up to the people involved to put in some work to make sure the movie's actually good. Because if it tanks, it sucks. It's Green Lantern. You have the Green Lantern. So a relationship could either be the Avengers or the Green Lantern. No one wants... No one wants the Green Lantern. If you would like more relationship advice, check out my mainstream channel where I have a couple of videos on relationships. Alright, so that's it for this video. Leave a comment down below on what you guys want for next Motivation Monday. Just tell me how you want it. Tell me how you want it. Tell me how you want it. Ooh. Also, I'm currently recording a video for my next mainstream channel video. It should be up in about two weeks. Ooh, exciting. Alright, so love you guys. See you guys later. Stay awesome. Bye!